Alrighty. Hello. What is up? Welcome, welcome back to the channel. I don't know why I feel so stiff. Hey you guys, if you're new here, my name's Chanel. What's good? I am your resident movie watching BFF. This is the channel where we watch movies together and I let you know what's going on in my head the whole time I'm watching them. When you come here, we like to call out filmmaker elements because that's my favorite way to watch a movie. And if you are here, I hope it is your favorite way to watch a movie as well. Don't forget to stick around to the end of one of my watches because we do the trivia section together. I really like to go hit up IMDb movie trivia. It's um, my favorite thing ever. And I think behind the scenes trivia and blooper reels are the reasons I wanted to get into acting and performing and filmmaking in general. So that's all you need to know if you are new here. Today's video is going to be The Departed from the year 2006. I've been meaning to catch this for decades at this point. Well, okay, it's not two decades old yet, but I've been meaning to catch this for a long time because my parents have this on DVD. I am excited because I feel like being Italian really into those mob movies. And I think this is going to be mob, but it is going to be Boston and Irish. Director Martin Scorsese, I mean, come the frig on. The only thing absolutely flipping me out is two and a half hours. And I'm really nervous about my comprehension. I have difficulties comprehending when there's a lot of talking, undercover work. So I'm gonna need your help on this one. I'm sure I'm gonna get some stuff wrong. I will try to look it up after. But, you know, let's just, let's just make fun of, I'm gonna try to like go into this lighthearted and just make, poke fun of myself if I don't get it, you know? Because I don't like being wrong. It's one of, it's something I'm really trying to work on as an adult. As a kid, I was a little miss straight A's. And as an adult, we're allowed to be wrong. Adults are allowed to be wrong. I'm wrong all the time. So rest assured, if I get something wrong, if I mistake a identity or a face, I'm gonna keep it in. And you can just let me know. You can be like, hey, but you, but you can also be nice about it. That'd be nice. That'd be really lovely of you. Anyway, I don't usually read much, but I am gonna read this log line. An undercover cop and a mole in the police attempt to identify each other while infiltrating an Irish gang in South Boston. Oh, that's already gonna be so confusing. Undercover cop and a mole in the police. Well, good luck, Chanel. I could only hope that these are Matt and Ben to help me keep them straight. But I see Matt, I see Ben, I see Mark Wahlberg, Leo DiCaprio. Oh, and also I'm expecting Boston accents. Boston accents out the ass. There's gonna be guns. Potentially drugs? I don't know. What's his face? Don Corleone really wanted to stay out of drugs. So maybe these guys will too. I don't know. And that's that. That's that on that. So without further ado, let's get right into today's video, which is The Departed from the Year 2006. <laughs> Boston, some years ago. I want my environment to be a product of me. Environment. No one gives it to you. You have to take- Casual racism. I'm just loving the, the sets, the era we're painting. Carmen's developing into a fine young lady. Ew. Who is this? Is this Jack Nicholson? Who is this guy? You Johnny Sullivan's kid. Oh, that is an Irish child. You know where I am on L Street. Is this gonna be like a Goodfellas situation? Start him young? And uh, something may- They are backlighting Jack Nicholson so hard and they're not putting any light on his face. Do you see this? He's been in the dark. Oh my God. When you're facing a loaded gun. Now he steps into the light. Did you just see that? What's the difference? Oh my God. Chills. When you're facing a loaded gun, what's the difference? Steps into the light. Whoa, I just got chills. The filmmaking, that was so deliberate. <sighs> Pencils. Leo. School's out. Thank you, Frank. You earned it. Frank D. Congratulations on passing the detective's exam and welcome to the special investigation. Unit. Whoa, that Thank was you fast. Me. So, you got family connections down in Southie, right? Through your father? I got a question. How f by you? Okay, they definitely like Damon a little bit better, right? Normative behavior. And what's this got to do with me, huh? Why are you pretending to be a cop? Why are you pretending to be a cop? Because it's like in his blood to be a criminal? <gasps> Alec freaking Baldwin. By enhanced cooperation with the FBI, 
represented here today by Agent Frank Lazio. Frank Lazio. But of course, the rock star, you know who. We've done a briefing book, so read up. I want to get all ideas. <gasps> oh my God. Matt Damon's main man. You, however, grew up on the North Shore, huh? A lot of f***ing die. You were kind of a double kid. Did they just bring him in here to be mean? I'm just like very confused. What's the matter, smart ass? You don't know f***ing Shakespeare? <laughs> Five years from now, you could be anything else in the world, but you will not be a Massachusetts state trooper. Are you sure of that? Are they like gonna overlook his good grades and just be like, never let him have it because of who his family is? It's got an alarm in it in case you have, uh, you know, eating issues, which is a joke, not a very funny one. Well, there's a great view of the State House, Beacon Hill, if you can see it. Which is a joke, not a very funny one. <laughs> and are you a married state police detective or? No. Who's interested? Place and I have a co signer. Oh, cool. Yeah, you tend to have a house guest. That's cool. Great. His co-signer is about to be the head of the mob, Jack Nicholson. F. Costello. I think we know who that is. We're thinking a guilty plea to assault and battery would make sense. Given your nature, you've already pretended to be a Costigan from South Boston. All right. They want him to go on the inside, undercover. So this is the mole. Oh, this tracks. Wow. What an opening, friends. What an opening. Cranberry juice. It's a natural diuretic. My girlfriend drinks it when she's got a period. It is a really good diuretic. <laughs> you understand that? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Oof, playing by the street rules, friends. You will not ever know the identity of undercover people. So, I'm tired from your wife. How's your mother? Good, she's tired from my father. You already know, stole 20 microprocessors from the mass processor company. I don't remember. Microprocessors. Southie Projects. What was his name? The Departed. Miles Kennefick. Got the job <gasps> to forge you mass. The Departed. My theory on feds is they're like mushrooms. The girls have a good day. <laughs> wow, such an insult all the time. Ladies, you're a girl. Into the neighborhood. Different breed down here, Sarge. I need to know if Costello knows that he became a cop. He must know. Right? <gasps> Vera Farmiga. I love her. She's the best. Gotta use their service revolver in the course of duty, and then they get to come to talk to you about their feelings and whatnot. Shrink. Yeah, that's right. Fancy. Are you a stadium? Uh, yeah, I am. I'm, I'm actually going to law school also. Uh, Suffolk, can I? Liar. I'll stab someone in the heart with a face <laughs> pick if it gets me dinner with you. No, sir, I'm just joking. I need the cut. That was smooth as f I really liked that. That was good. They were flirting and both were in. She wants to come back there and squash your head. Hey, you fellas come from Providence? Is there something oh. Oh. Yes, music kicks in. So amazing. Now you also do probation. <laughs> Jeez. I don't even know what it is. <laughs> is that Marissa Tomei? That's Marissa Tomei. I'll always have a job. I'll just arrest in it. Man, you are trouble. No, you don't know the half of it. I'll arrest you, right? I'll be running away from this man. I'll be like, hell no. Come with me. That was an interesting insert shot. Cup to the glass to the table. I'm gonna have my associates search you. No, no one's search me. Search me for what? Contra band. Take your shoes off. Great tie, by the way. Sorry I didn't say anything sooner. Oh, this is harder than like. The horror movie blood. This is like real life pain. It kills me. I saw a dead guy. I think I'm having post traumatic. Girlfriend. Can I meet you for lunch? All right, see you then. No one weaves a story like Scorsese. I mean, it's like unmatched. It just builds and builds and is so beautiful. It's a small surveillance subunit, but it's mine. And I didn't take this. So I'm thinking 
or so Leonardo DiCaprio has to figure out who is selling. Now a prime has to figure out Matt Damon is basically working with this guy. I got promoted. All right. This is awesome. It's like he actually is a cop. <laughs> you can't do that. You just did. You're my attorney. What do you think? <laughs> now, if you this is illegal as fuck, right? You can't do this. That's why he said turn the camera off. Holy sh! That was fast. So, do you want to talk about last night? What did they do? I would like to know. Please tell me. You know, it's all right. Guys tend to make too big a deal out of it. What? It's actually quite common. I gotta go to work. <laughs> talk about feelings. That girl's gonna kill him. I wanna mess with truth. Yeah, you lie. <laughs> You lie. Well, I expect that some people do it to keep things on an even keel. Smart. So you had a parent who was a drunk. Oh, yeah, it's up leaving when I came in. How did you know he was a cop? You no know, bad haircut, no dress sense, and a slight, you know, air of scumbag entitlement. Mm -hmm. <laughs> was it Matt Damon? Well, I'm not them, all right? I'm not them, okay? You signed the papers, remember? Now, we're the only two people on the face of this earth that even know you're a cop. No, they're like blackmailing him. When are you gonna take Costello, huh? I mean, what's wrong with taking him on any one of the million f***ing felonies that you've seen him do? Yeah, let's go. You want the truth? Valium. Close my file? I didn't Is that what you're gonna your do? File. I, I know, I, I know. I thought I was supposed to tell- She's not a great therapist. <laughs> Have I done my job up to your goddamn standards? You know, I'm too damn bad if you don't like my initial clinical reaction. Thank you. I'm transferring you to another counselor. Yeah. So you want to get a cup of coffee? Do not. Do She better not say yes. Oh my god. They better not go on a date. Our target is a major transaction of microprocessors. Yes, so. I feel like they chose microprocessor for the accent. <laughs> Hey. I'm sorry to get you the last minute, but things leak. This lead came from Queen is undercover guy. I'm Damon's like, oh no, how do I tell Frankie? Oh no, my friends are still coming. All right, thanks, Pa. Bye. Call the game. Oh my god. How the heck did he send that blind? No shot. For his own good, tell Bruce Lee and the Karate Kids, none of us are carrying on. Fucked up. What you see there for service is what you're gonna get. Yeah, why the f did they turn their phones off? Wait. Someone tipped them off. This is unbelievable. Who put the f***ing cameras in this place? I'm the guy who does his job. You must be the other guy. The other guys. Mark Wahlberg movie. Oh, fuck, Leia. Le chaka chaka. Got the microprocesses. <laughs> I wonder if Matt Damon clocked that they have a guy on the inside with the phone and that it's Billy. <laughs> they were ready to pinch these guys. Got his script. Your life radically. No, they didn't go get coffee. This is. So I'm not okay. Hello? What the f is it with you and your phone? Huh? Yeah. Do you like Little Miss Things sucking on your That's intense. Yes. Yes, I do. <laughs> yes. Yes, I do. I'm gonna get you. If you coulda, you woulda. But I guess you like to go at your own pace. I'm dead at the angels. A date with some angels. It's really confusing how they don't have enough to pinch this guy yet. Like, what? They've got plenty, I would think. This is where I don't understand the law. I gotta pay Costello and wait for him to trade me to the FBI? Because that's what he does! Just tell me what you just f***ing said. <sighs> I hated that. I hated that. I hated that. I hated that. 
Costello's a protected FBI informant. I thought I was supposed to go into the shock. I'm not in shock. <laughs> I'm loving the way this is told. It is great. I'm not having as many comprehension issues as I thought. He's a protected informant. I mean, aren't they always trying to make it a federal case and it never gets made? Okay. Starting to come out. What are we, like halfway? Halfway through this movie, maybe? Cash business myself. What's he doing? Setting up IRAs? Just fill the fucking paper in. Your real name and all your account numbers. Come on, come here. That ain't right. <laughs> Someone went to school, buddy. I'm not staying, all right? You could tell him I said that. She's pouring out there. I want them together. I like them better. Are they gonna hook up? <laughs> Guys, do it. Do it. Yes. This is what I wanted. I love it when I get what I want. Yes. Okay, Martin Scorsese, do we cut away or what? Like, what's going to happen? Yeah, like a pan away, a very tasteful pan down. This is great. This is great. This is great. Great. She's a doctor. Oh, that's outstanding. Yeah. Marriage is an important part of getting ahead. Let's people know you're not a homo. Very key. Yep. Marriage makes them people know you're not gay. I didn't love that. Was that fake? I hope that was fake. When everybody looking up their own ass and you looking for yourself, I put my money on nobody finds nothing. I gotta find myself. I get it. The guy who's me for them. Oh, it's getting good. She's getting so good. It's getting good. <gasps> They literally are each other. Look, you guys, they're wearing like the same outfit, same hat. I gotta find me in your department. Oh, costuming is making sure to dress them the same. Hoodie, jacket. <laughs> Who writes this sh <gasps> Does he get away with that one? That's... Bad. It's an innocent person. Put our camera at the height of a surveillance camera. That's it for me. Oh no, why, why, what does that matter? You accused me twice. I quit. Okay. I like his tactic. I like his tactic. Go back at him. I got this rat. This annoying. Oof, now it's like personal. Like now he just wants to kill the rat. I'm not the f***ing rat, okay? You said there is one, all right? I base most of what I do on the idea that you're f***ing good at what you do. Flatter him, butter him up, love it. Love it, love it, love it. In the future, I tell you to do a thing. Do it, you got that? <gasps> I got it. What the f***, what the f***, what the f***, what the f***, what the f***. I got my, okay, Francis, cigarette. Oh my god, I thought he was gonna like get him from behind. Kill him or something. You're gonna be looking at my people. Going through their bank statements, their phone calls, and medical records. Cool. That effect, they're closing in on him. Look, if we're not gonna make it, it's gotta be you that gets out. Because I'm not capable. Mm. Something about being Irish, isn't it? I'm Irish, I'll deal with something being wrong for the rest of my life. I've heard this quote before. I'm Irish, I'll stay forever. Of course I know how to spot a car. How's oh, that? Oh, okay. You get it now, do you? <laughs> Every, so it's like everyone's a cop then? What about this guy? A cop. You can get out of here. I'm using a new crew tonight, new guys. What Take the night off. Okay, Francis, what were you just doing? Jimmy out the back. Bring a mop. In a pail. Mop in a pail. No. What? You're ignoring us. You're a cop. We're guessing who cops are. You know, most good looking women are cops. Oh, shit. 
Listen, I need to see you today. No, 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 today. You heard nothing about drugs. No. Nothing about new guys. Nothing about Gloucester. Not a thing. And I would have. That information would have come to me. Hmm. Would it have come to you? That was a test. Send him home. Playing with his new guys. Bill reports it. Matt Damon thinks it would have come back to him. I don't know. I want constant surveillance on Captain Queenan, starting right now. Good, thank you. Oh, this is such a yikes. This is getting so scary. Queenan, find out about the good Catholic life. I have to follow every lead. However unlikely, follow him and don't get made. Don't get made. Is there any reason you would have a tail? No. On station, wait 10 minutes. Good thing they have service under there. 344 wash. You got that? 344 wash. Who is gonna catch who first? I don't know. I don't know. Sooner or later, he's gonna find out who I am and he's gonna. F We've been trying to reach you. We found the rat. Listen, we're gonna take him out. Now look it. The address is 314 Washington Street. You got it? Now one of the cops he's got on the inside tipped him. Come on, come on. Oh my god. At least Billy is still reading like not a problem. Billy can just be like, guys, I beat you here. What's it to you? Oh, they think it's him. That's good. They think it's him. <laughs> it's good for Leonardo DiCaprio. All Billy has to do is get down there and be like, I'm here to help. I'm here to help. <gasps> no. <sighs> okay, all right, okay, all right. Okay, all right, okay. Oh, this is, this is coming to a lovely head. It's him, it's him, it's him, it's him. An information in a locked file. I forgot the password, but if you want to come down to the garage with me, I'd be happy to give it to you. It's a Work with the tech guys to unlock those files. Dig them, take a leave of absence. Well, then you show up today. It's a rat. <laughs> yeah. So? Okay. I called you. Hmm? I made a mistake. I, I gave you the wrong I was going to say, he didn't give him 344. He did not. Tell me why I didn't tell nobody. <sighs> well, that's lucky. That was very lucky. Lucky, lucky, lucky. The lucky guy, Billy. He's so hot for me, we give him a whiff of my ass, he'll crawl right in it. Let's give him a whiff. Give him a whiff of my ass, he'll crawl right in it. 10 out of 10 dialogue, baby. That's a perfect line. I'm sorry. She's sleeping with the two, the mirror images of each other. Yeah. She's gonna tell, I want her to be the one to deliver the information. It's a great phone, sturdy, not even a little bit shattered. An iPhone could never, an iPhone would never be shattered. Glass everywhere. Oh, he's about to have him. He's about to have it. No, don't pick it up. Don't you dare pick it up, Billy. Don't pick it up, Billy. Bilbo, don't you dare. Matt Damon, speak first. Speak first. Out yourself. <laughs> who is gonna out who? I'm so scared. Yeah. Who are you? So it is you. I'm taking over Queenan's unit. We need you to come in. Can you come in? Or meet me. Got him. He knows it's Billy. F hey, no. Proceed. They need to get Francis, or else. Queenan's guy. He called me when he found out Queenan was dead. I'm running him. You're running him. You give him to me. Stand by. We'll take this prick tonight. Yo, Matt Damon is playing these f It's become a real rat race. Cat and mouse game. The last frames of this movie better be Matt Damon, Leonardo DiCaprio in each other's faces. Oh. Maddie Mats. Grow up. Of course I talk to the FBI. Oh, the FBI was dirty, right? The FBI was dirty. 
this whole time? Never gave up anybody who wasn't going down anyway. What? They said the FBI would compromise. I found this on the web. Oh my god. To you? Is that what this is about? All that murdering and no sons. That's it. That's it. R.I.P. Francis. He's been talking to the FBI this whole time? Really? Tell me he gets away with this. Oh my god. Good to see you, Trooper. Now, how long were you undercover? I can't even tell you the debt. I hate this. Being a cop's not an identity. I want my identity back. What are you gonna do about Costello's rat in this building? I'm gonna find him, I'm gonna arrest him. It's me, hi, I'm the problem, it's me. <laughs> Taylor Swift said it best, friends. Come on, so we gotta find out that it's him. <gasps> what, what does he say, what does he say, what does he say? He has the, the envelopes. Citizens. I knew they really made a meal out of that envelope. Oh, this is so good. This is so well done. Wow. Run, bitch, run. I know, I'm not, I'm not here for that, okay? This is for you to hold. You open this if something happens to me or if I call you and I tell you to open it. I respect it. I respect it. He's right. No one else. Open it. Really? Yeah. Is she pregnant? What is it? What is it? It's having a son. Oh my god. Oh my god. Is it gonna be Billy's kid? Play me now. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Got a cop in my crew. Yeah, I know. I'm. You know what? I thought I was the liar. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Where Queen and died, you keep your cell on. I wanted them to face off. I love it. It feels like we're gonna settle this off the books. You know, which is the kind of movie we're watching, baby. I can get you your money. What Just did you say? I can get you your money. Boom. He was working for me. He was my informant. He's Costello's rat, all right? I got boxes of tapes, evidence, other documents proving it. Don't make me put my weapon down, buddy. Don't make me do it. Okay, but like, where is Dignam though? Get him up. Great sneaker, great sneaker on. Is that Anthony Anderson? It's a new, it's a new balance dad's shoe, you know? Damn, this movie just don't let up. Thank you. Set, he's got end of his. Room. I am killing you. Just kill me. <gasps> Did you see how nonchalant I was, just drinking my water, thinking everything was fine and dandy, and we were done? <gasps> Costello was gonna sell us to the FBI. It's you and me now. You understand? We gotta take care of each other. You understand? I didn't, I didn't see any of this coming. I saw none of this coming. Zero percent. So now we only have his girlfriend and the envelope. If anything happens to me, you open it. <sighs> Matt Damon is the bad guy. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. What about the baby? Not yours, buddy. I'm so mad. I didn't want Leonardo DiCaprio to lose or die in this. And b both happened. Search the place. Okay. Justice is served. Damn, everything is like above the law, under the law, under the table. Everyone is just getting their justice where they can get it serving it up themselves <sighs> there was no official anything about that no official cop business there god damn is that it is that gonna be it Kura! 
that's got to be some sort of municipal law building too, right? Like just the ultimate symbol of, <laughs> yeah, that end. what's that ending shot? I got to write that down. You guys, I'm a little shiny. <laughs> the Departed from 2006. Wow, 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 wow. We, we knew it was going to be good. It's Martin freaking Scorsese. Did we know it was going to be this good? No. Who would have thought? Not me. Holy balls. That's a good movie. That's one of the best movies ever made. It's up there with The Godfather for me. Whoa. Wow. That was insanity. I felt really good about how that unfolded. I didn't feel like I was sitting here for two and a half hours. I felt really settled. The camera work, the filmmaking, the storytelling, the way it unfolds, like a beautiful blooming onion. I can't, I can't find anything wrong with this movie. We're definitely, okay, so it won four Oscars and it deserves it. This is insane. We're gonna go right to the trivia section. I couldn't imagine a better film. It's too good. Best motion picture of the year, best achievement in directing, Scorsese, best writing, adapted screenplay, best achievement in film editing. And Wahlberg was nominated in a supporting role. Weird that Leonardo DiCaprio was not nominated. Super weird, because he carries this for me. I'm gonna guess... You could make this for less, but with star power alone, I'm gonna put this, I don't know if it's as high as a $100 million movie. Let's call this a $75 million movie, 90 million. Hmm, I almost said 90 and then I thought that was a really weird number to say. Okay, let's go look at some trivia. I don't really have questions, so we'll just see what we can find out for fun, for funsies. Leonardo DiCaprio called his one-on-one -on -one scene with Jack Nicholson, one of the most memorable moments of my life. Chills, goofum, goosebumps everywhere, <laughs> goofbumps. Leonardo DiCaprio described his character as being in a constant 24 hour panic attack. You know, I got that, but I also didn't get it because I feel like this character would mask it. So it's like we get it, but he's also not breaking down 24 seven. He's about to shatter at all times. And I think it's the right call. I think Leonardo kills it. <laughs> Mark Wahlberg easily fell back into his native accent. Okay, this is what I thought for budget. Rus roughly half of the $90 million budget went to the actor's salaries. That makes total sense. Vera Farmiga met with real LAPD psychiatrist to prepare for her role. The psychiatrist read the script and told Farmiga that Madeline did pretty much everything wrong. I thought so. I, that is not how a psychiatrist would behave. She gets really shaken by them and she sleeps with both of them. <laughs> so, oh, this is a remake of a foreign film? Maybe I have to do Wolf of Wall Street on the channel next. I was gonna say, this felt very New York, especially that little convenience store. It says Scorsese wanted to shoot the film in Boston where the story is set. The bulk of the film is shot in New York and partly due to concerns about setting up production and politics, partly because New York's 15% filmmaking tax credit. They shot in Boston for three weeks in June and three more in August. After the success of the film, Massachusetts created a 25% tax credit for filmmaking. Yes, this is a really common thing that states will do to bring productions to their state. They will provide incentives to shoot there. And New York has a good one. Oh my God, Matt Damon decided his character should be impotent to counter Frank's macho personality. Does that confirm that the baby is Billy's, maybe? I was gonna say, that is a view from Colin's apartment. It is a view of the Massachusetts State House. It was an effects shot from the roof of Suffolk University, which is the law school where Sullivan says he is taking night classes. Cinematographer Michael Bellhouse evaluated the shot during pre-production. That ending shot is on a state building how telling oh there's no evidence that freud said the thing that irish are impervious to psychoanalysis f word is used 238 times oh the microprocessor acts as a macguffin a device which only serves merely as a trigger for the plot as per the hitchcock definition we haven't talked about macguffins on my channel in a long time but definitely look it up it's fun wow okay that was great that was freaking great Okay, so across the board, I freaking love The Departed from the filmmaking to the script writing to the cinematography to the acting. I can't find anything wrong with this movie, so you're gonna have to sound off below and let me know what you think of The Departed. If you want more from me, slash my full length to this, Patreon information in this description box below. Otherwise, support the channel below. Sound off, let me know. Did you see this in theaters? This was 2006, so it's not as old as some of the movies that we've seen on the channel, so I'd imagine a bunch of you might have seen this one in theaters. I've been meaning to catch this for years. My family loves it, my cousins love it. I am just so excited now to let these themes wash over me and this above the lawness, and um, I will be studying this camera and this blocking for the rest of my life, because Martin Scorsese is the goat. He's the best. In any case, just an amazing movie, so let me know what you think. Patreon below, and of course, as always, on that note, I'm gonna go eat.